I have to imagine there's probably hardcore radiation in here as well, right? So, let's start moving. Uh, no, no radiation. Police department! Cool, we might find some wet. Uh, this is no good. This is no good at all. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to... Day R Survival. I'm your host, the comrade in the post-apocalyptic Russia. Notice the Birdman Falcon. So, two things before we get underway over here today. Number one, it is that um, I'm actually surprised how many people knew about this game. In the comments of the first two videos, a lot of people were saying it's a great game. Falcon, get wrecked, bitch boy. So, I'm surprised a lot of people already knew about this, which is great to hear. I got a lot of good advice as well, so I do appreciate that. Number two, I am also rolling with a new emulator. Today, we're using Droid 4X. I had issues with... Blue stacks. remember that's the reason why my video was a bit delayed, my audio was crackling. So I'm using Droid 4X here today, and it seems to be working just fine. Um, right now we want to check out Vidya Vejevo, or Vidya... <laughs> Vidya Yevo. Before we check out the quest marker here at the, um, airport. So, let's, um, stop dilly-dallying around and zoom on in. And I guess we will just come in here, huh? Right? Okay. Let's, um, come down here. Now, one of the things that I want to do is that people have been telling me, Falcon, you need a bike. <laughs> like, it's not even a joke, too. Like, I need a form of transportation because on foot, it's going to take forever to get to my destination, and you're right. So, I got to keep an eye out for bikes and also a way to make tools, but in order to make tools, I need to level up my mechanic skill or something like that. I don't know, but it's going to be a while before that actually happens. And I also need to take care of uh, radiation, so I can't really dilly-dally too much around here, too. We have firewood, dirty water, flint, skull, and iron pipe. I think I need the iron pipe to make a shotgun. Um, I'll show you my recipes here pretty soon. I have unlocked some stuff along the way, because I've been, you know, as I mentioned, I took my time scavenging. So I did uncover a couple of, um, skills along the way. Well, not really skills, but recipes, really. What, are you kidding me right now? What, what's with this shit here? Oh, come on! Where's this iron pipe at? You motherfucker, look how much time I've been spending here. Um, you know what? What if, um, do I have a torch? No, I don't have a torch. Okay, you know what? Let's make a torch here really quickly. No, no, Falcon. Radiation, radiation is gonna be a problem. Um, need to kindle you. Kindle up. Oh, come on. Really? Where's my, <laughs> where's my thing at? Where, look, here's the new stuff I got. I'll, I'll cover this later on, though. Right now, we're dealing with, um, radiation, which is no good. Uh, come over here. No, go, go back here. Go in here. It's like, I'm acting like I've never played this before. Rags? Oh, come on now with your rags. I don't have rags, that's really surprising. Well, I could tear you down for rags. There it is. Okay. Now we come back over here, there's my torch, make it. It should give us the loot bonus as well. Alrighty. I don't have to equip it, so we should be fine. Now, can I find this goddamn iron pipe? Oh, you've gotta be taking the piss right now. You have gotta be taking the piss! Oh, look, you found a dirty water. Oh, how great. Uh, how about the pipe that you guys are... Falcon's getting very upset right now. You know what? Fuck this. Okay? Fuck this pipe. G give me this. I'm leaving. All right? You, you, you've won, game. Okay? You, you happy? You won. I'm out of here. Let's go check this out over here. And, you know, in the least, I got myself a torch, which obviously is doing wonders for me. Oh, the canteen? This could be pretty good for food, so I'm not going to complain too much. I'm really overweight here, huh? 81? Why am I carrying all this wood? Yo, dog, get out of here. We don't need you right now. You're just taking up valuable inventory spots for me. Okay. Explore. Um, furniture, corn groats, rusk, rotten vegetables, salt. Okay, let's, uh, move saucepan. Ooh. Search it up. Come on, man. Radiation's building up. I'm worried. No, I don't care about the furniture. Is this like a joke now or what? Oh, you can't... F <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, this isn't even great stuff. I just want to find something at this point. I'm, I'm starting to worry that there's just nothing left over. No, no, I, I want to pick this up, too. I don't really want the rotten vegetables. You can keep that. And I'll take you for the radiation illnesses down the line. Rotten vegetables, I don't need that. Eh, that's about it, really. Do I got any food over here to eat straight up? I haven't made any. Mmm, no. I've been trying to limit how much food I'm making because obviously it does go bad after a while. So, there is that. Um... Let's have a little bit of this here, and we'll have a, a, a water. There we go. Radiation is still going up, so we gotta get on out of here, I think. Yeah, I'm really disappointed with what we found here. Got the road. Any sort of bikes here. Mm, broken car. I think we have enough fuel right now, so I'm not really too worried about that either. 
You know what, this is a terrible spot. Let's just check this house out and we leave. Definitely leave. We're not really finding too much of value here. Pants, canned beef, furniture, wire. Um, if I could find some canned beef straight up, that would be very ideal, but <laughs> look at this, I can't find shit now. Oh, we got one wire. Okay, what? you know, I'm done with this place. I hate this place. Get out of here. Vidyayevo, you, you're the worst place imaginable for me ever. I'm going to the airport now. I'm leaving. Get that radiation down, please, okay? There we go. Um, let's see. I'm gonna probably have to make some food here at some point. We'll, we'll probably also rest before we get into the airport, because I'm not sure what to expect in there. That could be like a quest marker. I mean, it is a quest marker, but it could be like... You gotta fight something really dangerous. You guys told me about radiated bears. Stop. Stop momentarily. This is way too high. Um, you guys told me about radiated bears, so I I'm actually worried what the hell you guys meant. I'm sure you guys are trolling me or what, but um, somebody mentioned radiated bears, and I'm kind of like, okay, well, that's terrifying. Chop some wood over here. I'm gonna make myself a little bit of a small tent, and... A f intense hunger? Yeah, I know it's intense hunger time. <laughs> Believe me, game, I got it. I, I got it under control. Uh, I'm trying to, like, you know, make this first so we could actually... Oh, we got 20, which is exactly what we need. So, survival. Make myself the fire. We'll use the torch. It's about to break anyway, and we'll... What do you mean I don't got enough firewood? It required 10 for the... for the dude? For the... the... the, the fireplace? That's surprising. Okay, I thought it was 5. What do I know? What the hell do I know, really? Alright, there it is. Make it now. I know it's high, don't you worry, we'll eat something right now. Um, come back over here, and let's see. We're gonna make something out of rice. I've had rice for a while, what is this? This is the wheat groat. Yeah, let's use the rice here. So, let me just make one really quickly to eat now, so that meat over here starts building up. There we go. And now we'll just cook everything else that we can, so... Let me do five meals right now so we can eat a couple and we'll have a couple in hand. But again, the thing is, I don't want to make a lot of them in one go because they will expire, which is no good. So, here we go. And we also have to get some rest before we get into the airport. So... You know what? Rest up now. Rest up now! Rest up like a hurricane! Bow, bow. Uh, I don't think that actually works out, too, because a hurricane's very violent, and you usually, when you think of a, hur a hurricane, it's not really, you know, resting, it's always, like, you know, causing chaos and destruction. Oh, yeah! Apparently, if I want to wake up, like, without having to, like, get completely healed up down here, or, like, you know, rested up, or starved to death, <laughs> you guys told me I could find an alarm clock. I'm actually really quite surprised what I learned about from this game, reading your comments. Like, I was just like, what the fuck, an alarm clock? That's crazy. It's amazing. It's actually really quite amazing, really. It sounds ridiculous, but it's actually quite amazing. I was quite surprised. So, now that we got no food, let me drink you, and I do at least want to have a couple of meals, because I'm not sure what to expect in the airport, so I want to have, like, a couple of meals there just in case. I think five rice is just about good enough. We're at 53. We have some clean water. Oh yeah, before we leave, let's um, boil you up, huh? How about that? There it is. Okay. And before we get in there, let's also equip the axe, just because uh, I'm not sure what's going to be in there. Uh, I'm also wearing a face rag, which is supposed to help me out with radiation. Y you can make it out of rags very easily um, down over here. Let me show you the recipes, by the way. This is all the, the new stuff I picked up just by scavenging a lot. Here's the cookery stuff. I actually made some pasta. It recovers a lot of, um, hunger, but, um, you know, it's not really worth it, I don't think. I'd just rather make the wheat grow and stuff like that. Over here's the chemistry stuff. Here's the mechanic stuff. I made the- the reason why I was trying to find that pipe is because I can make myself a shotgun, which sounds really amazing. Shotgun over here, and I guess these are the pellets for it, but, um, yeah. That's the reason why I wanted to find that pipe, to make myself a shoddy, but no such luck. And what I'm looking to get is forging. We need to level up forging, which um, requires me to... I'm at level 4, I mean 4 of 10, so I need 6 more experience points in that to unlock this. And this will let me make um, cool weapons, and also amazing armor. Look at this, I could apparently become a, a Russian knight. It's amazing. Okay. I think we're ready to hit the road. So... Let's go into the airport. Not sure what to expect here. Maybe I should have saved beforehand, huh? Ah, well. Here we go. Retribution. Exploring the cellars, I found a tightly sealed door. It must be a bomb shelter. There must be some food supplies. Tap the upset button to accept the quest. I'm um, sure. I have to get some information about this bomb shelter. I will look for it in the Murmansk surrounding area. There must be a way to open this door. Military base. 
Okay, that's not too far, luckily, for us. That's not too far. <clears throat> so, otherwise, there's nothing else here in the airport, is what you're telling me. Really? Nothing else here at all? No. Nothing here. Okay, so... The military base in Murmansk. Well, with nothing else to do, we might as well go there now. Now, can I cross this water? This is water, correct? <laughs> oh, my God. oh, you know what? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Here's the crazy thing. I thought it was pretty silly, but I actually opened up a recipe... Oh, it's red. <laughs> no problem. I actually opened up a recipe for a, a raft. A, a legit raft, and I was thinking to myself, A raft? Why the hell would I need a raft? Well... You actually might need a raft. Let's um, come over here before we cross over. I want to find out about this. Let's go to inventory. And let me get some food in here. Boom, boom. That's good. Um, Yeah, check this out. Watch. You see that? A legit raft. And I was like, when I saw this, I was like, what? This is like a lot more advanced than the old scavenger in some ways. It's really surprising. It's all over. Mordomansk is dead. There is no electricity nor water. I will try to find something that can explain the awful deaths and the reason of my survival. Find the last issue of newspaper Murmansk Messenger. Cool. So where would I find that? Oh, okay, cool. It's going to be in here. So let's zoom in. I have to imagine there's probably hardcore radiation in here as well, right? So let's start moving. Uh, no, no radiation. Police department. Cool, we might find some wet... Uh, this is no good. This is no good at all. Two, two damage at losing? What the hell is this? What? Okay. Um. I can't escape? <laughs> Not available? I don't have a good weapon for this, man. I guess we have to go with the axe here. 46%. It's, it's a roll of the dice here. It was a failed attack. I had to run away. Oh, okay. So there is that. If you lose, you just don't get mauled to death. You do run away. Um, what is this here? Oh, bleeding. Uh, luckily for me, I do have a couple of um, bandages that I found at a pharmacy. And I was thinking, like, what what is this going to be for? I mean, I knew it was going to be for bleeding, but I never knew how you get that, but it's from combat. Okay, cool. And one of these bad boys heals up to five bleeding. So we're going to hold on to these, and then we're, we're a bit higher. We'll use it. Am I going to continue bleeding? Well, I guess we'll keep an eye out on it. Um, let's come over here and get some food really quickly. Alright. Well, we're running into dangerous enemies now. We're gonna probably have to definitely make a weapon here at some point. Let's explore the... Ooh. Oh, baby. Let's... Maybe we can find, like, a good stuff here because it is a police station, right? Oh, the bleeding's going down by itself, maybe. I'm at a one now. Ooh. Ammo for the Makarov handgun, huh? Alrighty, well... That's great, but right now we have to keep um, searching. We could find some cigarettes and a gas mask here. Oh my god! <laughs> what, what is this? I gotta be able to rock this, right? We have to rock this. Um, okay, hold up, hold up. Keep exploring, keep exploring. I really, hopefully we can find that Makarov gun. It's gonna be broken, apparently, but maybe there's a way I could fix it. I imagine there's gotta be a way, I just don't know. Oh, there it is, we have it. No! It's a Lynx again! Yo, dog, what are you doing? You stop stop fucking my shit up, man. I'm busy here. Hey! Why does it... Wait, you, son of a bitch. <laughs> what? Who are you calling a son of a bitch? Me or the, the lynx? I don't even know who it's calling a son of a bitch, but it's calling somebody a son of a bitch. Oh, we got animal skin, raw meat, and four bones. Very cool. All right, we actually won one. Um, alright, so, first and foremost, let's again get some of this in us here. The radiation isn't really too bad here, so I'm not too worried about it. Um, okay, let's go to the ground here. Ooh, we got some meat from that guy, too. And the gas mask, okay, very cool. Let's pick everything up, and it's gonna bring me up to 96, that's no good. That is no good at all. One of you fuckers weigh a lot, don't you? Well, I mean, I got so many pairs of pants here, we don't need all these pants, do we? No, we don't. I'll hold on to those bad boys for now. We got 28 cigarettes, too. I wonder if you could use the... Oh, you could smoke them. For fatigue. Oh, fatigue goes down? Really? Isn't it intoxicating me a little bit, though? Let's try it out. Yeah, it does work. <laughs> cigarettes are bad for you, even in the video game. Alrighty, so let's um, hit the road here. We got some good stuff out of here, and we still have to go to... Find a newspaper, don't we? Well, let's check this out. This might be the canteen. Last time it was a canteen, anyway. Road, intact house, let's explore. 
It's a canteen. Um, we could find some milk. No. Furniture, corn goats, rusk, salt, tea, knife, and saucepan. I feel like we already have a lot of those, so let's continue onwards here. What's down this side? A garage. <gasps> Toolkit! Search! Search it out! That is, um, tape? Yeah, it's tape. Um, but no, no. I, I would love this tool because we can actually start making my bike. I want to make a bike, man. Continue searching. No! Oh, it's a rat this time. Alright, rat man. 59% chance to beat the rat? Why is it so difficult? Wh why is this rat so hard to beat? Damage at losing 22? Why? What, what, what happened here? How is this possible? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Or is this like the, the most angriest rat of all time or what? Can we just escape? You should save the game from time to time to avoid the loss of progress. Oh. Well, I think I already did that game. You tell me to do it now? Oh, okay. Thank you. <laughs> cool. Thanks. Um, I just... Oh, the bike! We found the bike! Okay, cool. Where is that? Uh, it's weird. The game's telling me to do stuff now. Um, we need tools to fix the bike. Oh, oh disassemble the bike. No, no, I want to assemble it. I need spare parts. Oh, so I got to... I got to find a bicycle and then have another bicycle with parts. So I technically need these parts right now. I getcha. But we need tools. So continue exploring. Should I, like, make a... I don't know. Should I make the, the torch? I mean, last time it didn't help me for shit. Oh, tools! Yes! Okay. 194 uses. That's amazing. A crowbar? Oh, baby. You sound... Loot bonus 15? Yes! Oh, baby, it's a crowbar. Respirator? I think you absolutely should come along with me. Alright. Now... Oh, oh, dude, we might be able to make the bike. Hold up, hold up. So, we disassemble you. We got four parts. Oh, we can do it, guys. We literally need one more part to assemble the bike. Can you believe this shit? We were one away. One away from making it happen. Damn. So I guess what we should do is disassemble this one. We'll have the parts, and in the future, if we find another bike, we are ready to actually fix the bike. And get on the bike and travel on the bike. So that means you absolutely have to come along. Um, we're at 90... Oh my god, my, my weight's too high. Um, boy, oh boy. 84 is going to have to do. I'm a pack rat, it's a problem. You know, I like to carry a lot of shit. Let's go find that newspaper. Oh, look how slow we're traveling because of our weight. Damn. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Have that. <laughs> Have that. Is it helping me at all? Probably not. Explore. There's a cart here. <gasps> oh, dude, can we rock a cart like fucking Neil Scavenger? Tell me I can. That, that would solve all of my carrying issues right now. How's the radiation? 13. We might have to step out of the town to let our radiation go back down and then come back in here. Because obviously we have to find a newspaper first, but um, if we could get a cart as well, I would be a happy, happy camper. Explore. Continue searching. Find this goddamn cart. Um, I assume it's a, it's a shopping cart. Could be wrong. <gasps> this cart helps you carry more items. It's, is it fixed already? It's fine? How do I... No, no, no. It needs a... It needs a bicycle! It needs a bicycle! <laughs> oh, oh, my God. Why? A chainsaw would no... F I have a chainsaw. I, I, mean, I, I mean, I have a chainsaw, but I have fuel, which is apparently needed to tank it up. Fuck it, do it. How much do you weigh? 12. Oh, my God. All these items that I want, and I can't do it. All right, guys. Here's what I'm going to do. I obviously need to go through my inventory, and we're out of time anyway. I am going to wrap up the episode here. I'm going to take a look at my inventory. I need to get rid of some stuff and, like, you know, manage my weight <laughs> in the game. In real life, maybe. I don't know. It was a good uh, it was a good Christmas, so i got to manage my weight there, too. Hit the gym, baby. Um, but no, no. I need to manage my weight in the game and drop some stuff, which is going to be kind of boring. So I'm going to cut off the episode here because I'm out of time anyway. I'll come back next episode, and we'll continue onwards with, um, hopefully, a lesser load. Giggity, giggity. I hope you guys are enjoying it. I will catch you next time.